Mac is back. 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 First, I'd like to thank my wife Cindy and the singers. Did such a wonderful job, and I'm very grateful. My friends, you know, I'm past the age when I can claim the noun kid, no matter what adjective precedes it. But tonight, we sure showed them what a comeback was. declared is finished, I told them, I'm going to New Hampshire where the voters don't let you make their decision for them. Yeah. And when they ask, how are you going to do it? You're down in the polls, you don't have the money, I answered, I'm going to New Hampshire and I'm going to tell people the truth. this wonderful state we've come to trust and love. And we had just one strategy, to tell you what I believe. I didn't just tell you what the polls said you wanted to hear. I didn't tell you what I knew to be false. I didn't try to spin you. I just talked to the people of New Hampshire. I talked about the country we love, the many challenges we face together, and the great promise that it is ours to achieve. The work that awaits us in this hour on our watch to defend our country from its enemies, to advance the ideals that are our greatest strengths, to increase the prosperity and opportunities of all Americans, and to making our time, as each preceding American generation has, another better world than the one we inherited. I reasoned with you, I listened to you, I answered you, sometimes I argued with you. But I always told you the truth as best I can see the truth. And you did me the great honor of listening. Yeah. Thank you, New Hampshire. Yeah. before, that before I can win your vote, I must win your respect. And I must do that by being honest with you, and then put my trust in your fairness and good judgment. Tonight, we have taken a step, but only the first step toward repairing the broken politics of the past and restoring the trust of the American people in their government. The people of New Hampshire have told us again, that they do not send us to Washington to serve our self-interest, but to serve theirs. They don't send us to fight each other for our own political ambitions, but to fight together our real needs. They don't send us to Washington to stroke our egos, to keep this beautiful, bountiful, blessed country safe, prosperous, and proud. They don't send us to Washington to take more of their money and waste it on things that add not an ounce to America's strength and prosperity. They don't help a single family realize the dreams we all dream for our children. They don't help a single displaced worker find a new job and the security and dignity it assures them. They won't keep the promise we make to young workers that the retirement they have begun to invest in will be there for them when they need it. They don't, they don't send us to Washington to do their job, but to do ours. I didn't go to Washington. 
and to go along to get along or to play it safe to serve my own interests. I went there to serve my country. Yeah! is just what I intend to do if I am so privileged to be elected your president. Yeah!